The 76ers shooting has been beyond great up until now. How about 57% from the field overall? And on the floor for New York here in the fourth. They've got Robinson. Bogdanovich out there with the chew -up. Then it's Jalen Brunson. And it's McBride in at the two. And that's good. Robinson picking up the assist. McBride's got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for the Knicks. Lowry against Brunson. Lowry passes to Embiid. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brunson. That's his third foul of the game. And the 76ers with some changes. Bamba is checked in for Embiid. Reed comes in for Martin. And Cameron Payne subbed in for Kyle Lowry. Alec Burks checked in for the Knicks. Knicks on defense. A two-point game. With the drive, here's Payne. Not going to go that time. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Now here's Brunson. Payne covering. Just five to shoot. Looks good, is good. That's his seventh basket in 12 tries. And defensively, if you are not on point, Brunson more than capable of finishing inside. Now here's Payne, healed outside. It goes straight through with the switch. Heald's got 12 points here in the second half. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. you got to show some fire and keep defending. And Bogdanovich is a consistent shooter from outside. Once he's in rhythm, he's comfortable from firing from beyond. That's to Bamba. Let's it go with the three. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Second minute off the clock now in the fourth. Here's Brunson. Used the shot fake to create the angle, but couldn't get it to fall. Platoon passes to Payne. Heel from outside. And it's Jalen Brunson with the rebound. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for the Knicks. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Here's a Chua. Makes it off the glass. And now a seven-point Knicks lead. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Outside, Batum. He kicks it to Reed. Good on the triple. Something's brewing, guys. The three-pointers just continue to flow. Now the pass to Achua. Back to Brunson. Yes, indeed, it is good. He's now 8 for 14. And he's made his mark on offense especially. they got to be thankful he's on their squad. Here's Payne. Brunson covering. Now Payne passes it to Reed. Shot by Heel. Nobody around. No good on the triple. A good job by him on the glass here tonight. Plus eight in that department. Impeccable from the line since halftime. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. And one area where Brunson's improved is in the clutch. He's a monster in crunch time. Nice to have a player you can depend on in those key situations. Two shots. And falls for Brunson. Some changes for Philadelphia. Embiid, he's checked in for Bamba. Oubre comes in for Nicholas Batum. And it's Lowry in for Payne. Both shots good from the strike. And that's another area where he is just a superb player. Excellent at the free throw line. 
Brunson against Lowry. Embiid with a screen on Brunson. From downtown, it's rebounded by New York. Hartenstein's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Here's Bogdanovich. That one is good again. He's six for eight from the floor with the basket. How about the attitude of Bogdanovich? When he's got it going, he's looking to fire it every time. Outside Lowry. It's over Brunson. That one's in there. The New York leaders get back down to eight. Those were necessary points from Lowry. You love how each side has risen to the challenge throughout this one. Man, this has been a fun one. But look, who doesn't love a high scoring game? And the rejection by Lowry. Healed with it. Brunson picks him up. Has to Embiid. Puts up a deep three. Bogdanovich grabs the miss. Definitely a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. Has to Achua. the pass to McBride. And Brunson has it in the corner. And again, New York with the triple. He knocked one deep ball in the first half, but you start to get the feeling he's finding his rhythm out there now. The 76ers trail by 11. Lowry kicks to Embiid. They call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three point play. We see this so often. Embiid makes a strong move, drawing contact, and completes the play. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for New York. The name of the game in the modern NBA is making threes, spacing the court, and that's exactly what they are doing tonight. Another thing they've done well tonight is convert at the free throw line. May seem like a little thing, but boy, it can pay big dividends. A scoring machine. There's just no shot and beads afraid to take. The Knicks leading by eight. Master Brunson. it up off the glass. Brunson's got 18 points just in the second half. Talk about putting a team on your back. He has been dominant this quarter, and I don't think they are winning without him. Lowry passes to Embiid. The shot's good on the assist by Lowry. 23 points for Joel Embiid. Yeah, and every season, Embiid seems to improve as a scorer. And different elements and wrinkles to his game. Stein passes to Brunson. And that's a foul called on Kelly Oubre. That is his first foul of the game. And Philadelphia making a change here. Harris has checked in. Here's Hartenstein. And here is Ananobi. And the wide open shot from DiVincenzo. And another three for New York. And now with two three pointers in each half, he's really doing his all to help his team out from deep. Maxi finds Embiid. Robust move inside by Joel Embiid. Once Embiid has the ball in that spot, lights out. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for New York with a nine-point lead. Oubre against Hart. After DiVincenzo. Six to shoot. And here's Brunson outside. Philadelphia's gotten some tough luck from three-point range. In the fourth quarter, they've hit just one of six from deep. That's Demaxi. The pass to Embiid. Oh, and the jam by Embiid. Defense looks helpless against Embiid on that slam. He's just too physical. 
Brunson with it. Passes it to Anno. To Brunson. Pass to Hartenstein. And the shot goes in. And the Knicks lead by nine. Oh, what a find. The, the ball just comes out of Brunson's hands on time. Outside, Maxi. From past the arc. Cranes it from beyond the arc. Maxi's got 15 points in just the second half. That's a guy you want taking shots. A quality offensive player. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. Again, two break. Hart, that's good. The 76ers trail by eight. Axi passes to Embiid. It's rebounded by Hartenstein. Hartenstein's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the blast. Hart kicks to Brunson. And he's going up for the alley hoop. It's stolen by Lowry. To the paint. Here's Harris. Down it drops through the net for his ninth bucket. He is 9 for 13 so far. For now, over a decade, Harris has been getting buckets in this league. Another big night for Tobias. Brunson against Maxi. Brunson the pass to DiVincenzo. Here's Adenobi. And the layup falls. Adenobi has got 21 in the game. And can't do much else. The strength of Adenobi comes in handy on those challenging finishes. To the inside. MB. And MB throws it down. And guys, he's not an easy man to stop when he's got the rim in his sights. Never has been, never will be. He is a determined finisher. Oubre against Hart. And MB pulls it down. And you got to give credit to the D for never giving up on the play and doing just enough to bother him at the rim. Uber gets to Maxi. Lowry is screen on Brunson. The tray. That one's in there. The next lead is cut down now to just three on the bucket from Lowry. And the team counts on Lowry in moments like this. He keeps his cool and finds the big basket. Brunson, no good. Here's Philadelphia. They're on a 14-6 run. Harris dishes to Embiid. And they double up Embiid. Out to Harris. Embiid with a screen on DiVincenzo. And there's Embiid. That's good on the assist by Harris. And it's now only a one-point Knicks lead. New York's gone three or four from downtown here in the fourth. Brunson against Maxi. There's 49 seconds left in the game. And he's been a force on the glass all game long. It's because he's reading where the shots are going and getting to the right position. Just outworking everyone early on the glass. Embiid sets the pick for Maxi. Kicks it to Embiid. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. What a huge play coming through when it matters most. New York calls timeout. New York. They're down by one. 27 seconds left in the fourth quarter.
27 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. They're trailing by one. 27 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. And he can't stop the run as he misses. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. And looking at that replay again, just a big time block right there. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. And they go to the intentional foul. It's the first, and that will put them up by two. Solid at the line. We'll see if the late game pressure affects Maxi. Second one is good. We both at the line, and it's a three point game. And those were some big time shots. Those free throws helping make this a three point game. Here's Brunson. Good. And that shot brings them to within just one. Showing time and time again, he is comfortable being that first option. Brunson delivering in the clutch. Personal foul. Fifteen foul. At the line for your Sixers, Kyle Lowry. Two shots. He drops the first one, and that will put them up by two. Uh, the poise, Lowry more than prepared to step up in these moments. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. And it's all about the three right here. We'll see what they draw up. Three-pointer is a must. And here's DiVincenzo from the arc. Full time! And oh, that was an enormous three-pointer. And timeout called by Nick Nurse. one here. This was a crucial game for him, tying up the series at two apiece, Greg. A, a huge accomplishment. And this series, I think, hinged on who picked up game four, Kevin. I mean, now it's a three-game series, and anything can happen. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks, Kevin. Kyle, you get this win as you go out on the road. What changes when you go out on the road? Taking the road and do everything we're supposed to do. We do at home and taking the road. We got a tough team coming up. Uh, you know, well coached, well uh, play hard team, and uh, we got to go out there and try to get that win. Let's we'll see if we can keep this thing going. Thanks very much, Kyle. Back to you, Kevin. David, thank you as always. Well, that'll do it for now. Glad you could join us during this first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. This is Kevin Harlan saying thank you for tuning in. As we leave you with our New Balance Player of the Game. Joel Embiid.